Welcome to the Oasis. My name's Mike, and today I'm going to be showing you guys and girls how to apply the Oculus Runtime Error Fix. So if you, like me, jumped into Oculus Home yesterday, excited about checking out some fresh VR content, and then was faced with this, well, I can share your frustration because I was right there with you and faced the same error myself. Now this all came about because there was a certificate within the Oculus package that expired. Now Oculus were very quick to respond, acknowledge the issue and now they've released this patch which you have to apply to get back up and running in VR. So what I'm going to be doing in this video is showing you step by step how to download that patch, how to apply it and how to get you back into VR as quickly as possible. So I hope you guys enjoy this video so without further ado let's dive in. Here we are on my desktop. Now if I go over and double click on Oculus Home, you'll come up with this error, can't reach Oculus runtime service. Now this is the error that everyone is facing right now. So what you need to do is jump over to this uh, Oculus support page and I'll put a link to it in the description down below. Click on download install patch and let the patch download. It'll be about 3.9 megabytes, so not very big at all. Once the patch is downloaded, just double click on it and wait for it to fire up. Once it's fired up, it will give you an option and you just want to click on repair. And then it will come up with a message saying repair Oculus. Repairing Oculus will reinstall all of your Oculus software. Now that won't be reinstalling all of your games, it will just be the Oculus software itself. So go ahead and click on repair. Now it will download the Oculus software and reinstall it and that will take about 3 to 4 minutes. Once the installation is finished just go ahead and press next and that will fire up Oculus Home. If you head on over to your updates you'll probably notice that it's already downloading another update for Oculus Home. What you want to do now is close Oculus Home and restart it. Once you restart Oculus Home, you'll be faced with this and it'll say an update is required. Just go ahead and do that update. Once the update is complete, you can fire up Oculus Home and everything will be back to normal. I can confirm that everything works. I've tried a few VR applications, so let's jump straight to the outro. Okay guys and girls, so that is the end of the video and I hope this one helped you out to get back up and running with your Oculus Rift. Now I'm pleased that Oculus got this thing resolved within 24 hours but it is a bit of a pain that we have to go through this process to download an external uh, patch to then apply it to Oculus Home and then update and then get back up and running again and uh, it's a shame that something like this even happened in the first place but I'm glad that we've got this fix that we can get back into VR within no time. So I'd love to know your thoughts in the comments down below. Let me know, had you just picked up a Rift and this was your first day in VR for example or had you just picked up a game and you were really excited to play it and then you were locked out the system. I'd love to know in the comments down below. Leave a like if this video helped you out. Make sure you're subscribed for all my future content. Thanks again for watching and as always I'll see you on the next one. Cheers.